Every morning, I open my eyes, and for a moment, I forget. I forget that to everyone else, my world is a blur, and what I see as clear is a blend of shapes and colors to everybody else. I am technically blind, but I'm not completely blind like most people. Most people who are technically like 100% blind can't see anything at all, maybe lights, maybe movement, but I'm legally blind, which is a completely separate but very similar thing where you can see everything, but it's just not clear. My condition is technically degenerative, which means it should get worse with time, but it's been pretty stable since I was in fifth grade. Since it was supposed to be degenerative, it got worse when I was younger. When I was two, I was diagnosed, and my grandma found out, actually. My grandma saw me reading a book way too close, and she was like, whoa, that's not how you're supposed to read a book. It's weird to know that people know you as the blind girl. And it does make you feel different because when people meet you, like, people, when people meet me um, and they know me prior, they hear of me prior being like, oh, she knows Braille, she's blind, they expect someone else. Or when they meet me and they figure out that I'm blind after, it's this whole different world. They're like, whoa, you can't see. And I'm like, yes, yes, I cannot. Um, I love film and I love movies because um, as I grew up, I wanted to be a doctor actually, and I realized that I'm terrible at helping people. So I realized that the reason I wanted to be a doctor is because I love blood. So I started watching a lot of scary movies at a young age. I got super into like Halloween and blood and gore, and I started um, filming little things here and there just for fun, like nothing serious because I was like 10. Um, from that moment on, it became a fire to just become better. And as I went into high school, I took classes, I met people along the way, and they helped me become better and realize that film was what I wanted. I thought I wanted to be so many other things, but this is what I wanted to be. Film made me see things like everybody else. Like, my camera is my eyes for film. I use it to show people things and use it to show myself things that I couldn't see with my own eyes. When I watch films, uh, it's a lot like wa how everyone else watches them. I just, I'm able to watch them through the screen, through a camera lens, and it's just like there. I can bring it up as close as I want to my face and see all the detail at once, just like anybody else. I, you know, got super into, you know, the blood and the gore. And when you start watching those kinds of movies, there's a lot of witchcraft and spirits and things involved. And that always fascinated me. I thought it was so interesting that, like, if magic could exist, and if I could learn it. And I got really into, you know, paganism and Wiccans and tarot cards. And for Christmas one year, I asked for tarot cards and I learned how to read them. And it was just this whole way that I could learn to tell a future that I was so uncertain of because my condition while stable is degenerative and if I could use the cards to try to tell a future where something was okay then I felt more stable and okay I felt more stable and I felt more sure and I always had this secret stupid hope that yeah magic's real if it's if it's real I could use it to not be so blind. Since I was a little girl, until now, people have told me I can't do things, like the visual arts or reading. I see the world in a different way. I see things people don't see, and people see things that I will never be able to see. And I'm okay with that. 